The heel thumb test is an orthopedic test designed to differentiate syndesmotic sprains from lateral ankle sprains. Check out our online courses now. The link is in the video description. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. A high ankle or syndesmotic sprain is an injury to the distal tibiofibular syndesmosis. The distal joint is stabilized by several ligaments seen here. The injury most often occurs in sports and return to play times might be twice as long compared to usual ankle sprains. According to Hunt et al. in 2015, the mechanism of injury is a forced external rotation of the foot while in a dorsiflect position. The talus forces the fibula to separate from the tibia, rotate externally, and displace posteriorly, resulting in abnormal stress on the syndesmotic ligaments. The heel-thumb test lacks evidence in the literature, making it of questionable clinical utility. The test is performed with your patient in a seated position and with a relaxed ankle. The ankle will be slightly plantar flexed due to gravity. The lower leg is stabilized when the examiner gives a firm thumb on the center of the calcaneus. The force should be directed along the axis of the tibia. The test was first described by Lindenfeld in 2005 and considered positive when it produced pain over the anterior or posterior aspect of the ankle or in the distal leg corresponding to the area of the anterior or posterior tibiofibular ligament and interosseous membrane respectively. A positive test suggests a syndesmotic sprain diagnosed only when other associated injuries around the ankle are ruled out by examination and radiographs. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and if you're new here, subscribe to our channel for more videos every week. Check the links in the video description and take a visit to physiotutors.com. Here you can find an extensive list of online courses that will sharpen your skills as a clinician. I'm Max for Physiotutors and I will see you in another video.